Deaths on the rise as many sustain injuries in Ebony on New Year Day. No fewer than four more victims of the fire incidents which occurred on New Year Day in Akeze, evil local government area of Ebony State have been confirmed dead in the state. There were conflicting figures on Saturday evening on the total number of deaths recorded so far. Why a government official said only four of the victims admitted in the hospital have died. A source in the community disagreed, insisting that the casualty figure was higher than that. The source who spoke on the condition of anonymity said at least six persons have died while the remaining are in critical condition. The source added that one of those who died is a lady who wedding was coming up in a few days time. But the coordinator of Akese Development Center, Simbad Ubuatu, said he was only aware of four more additional deaths. Yes, I heard that four of those rushed to the hospital have died. The fire outbreak which occurred in Ihioji community in Akeze, evil local government area of Ebony State on New Year Day left a three-year-old baby dead with many others sustaining various degree of bones. The fire incident which occurred around 8 a.m. on Friday, January 1st, 2020 at the home of one Mr. Ogenyi Chuku was allegedly caused when a cannon loaded with gunpowder and left in the house at contact with fire. Chuku who narrated the incident to newsmen said their children and 11 other relatives were watching television in the house when suddenly fire engulfed the entire house leading to a pandemonium. The fire incident was triggered when a local made gunpowder meta known as Nkapolali placed close to the room where the children we are watching television suddenly sparked of fire the fire before being noticed has already taken over the entire room and the doors and windows of the room we are locked i kept the item in my house hoping to use it to celebrate the new year Having survived the COVID-19 pandemic and the NSAS protests, Chuku said, Chuku's father of some of the fire victims said that their joy in 2020 was short-lived due to outbreak of COVID-19 pandemic, which broke and brought economic and social lockdown. He said that one of the victims who was three years old died on the spot during the rescue operation why two others who sustained first-degree punt were immediately admitted at St. Denis Hospital, Ogidi, Akieze. He added that eight other victims were quickly rushed to the Alex Ekwemi Federal Teaching Hospital, Abakaliki. Spokesman of the police in the state, Lovett Oda, could not be reached for comment at the time of this report's end. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. My viewers, you see, the issue of um, fire inferno in a house or environment is something that one must not overlook. We, do, we, we must not overlook that. In fact, this will um, make me to suggest that just like every car used to have extinguisher, extinguisher so should every building or every house or every room should do in fact every rooms and every building should have a extinguisher in their house in case there is emergency because this that has just happened is accidental so hadn't been there is uh, any of the house is actually having an extinguisher that would have been useful and helpful at that moment that would have been used to quench the fire at that moment at least
but because there wasn't any that was why the fire was able to break out that that much you can see imagine the many losses that was made lives most especially we are no longer talking about properties again look at the three-year-old baby that reported dead you can imagine lord have mercy lord have mercy you see my viewers these are many things that we are complaining of that the federal government should intervene should intervene i um you see uh our firefighters our firefighters i won't say they are not trying but their trial their trying is not good enough it's not good enough they are not trying enough they are just like the nigerian police calling them for a particular service or for emergency is um is a complete waste of time sometimes because when you call them for a particular um, service they will tell you that they are coming but before they will arrive at the scene fire must have finished catching and setting the whole place a place you can see that so i will say that um, our nigerian firefighters are not meeting up with demand um, starting from the nigerian military down to the nigerian firefighters they are not meeting up public offices in nigerians are not meeting up to demand so they all need to be called to order most especially as we enter this new year 2020 2021 you understand so there should be a lasting solution to um, to situations most especially in this um, in this um, fire fire issue you understand because um, fire is not what we should joke or play with it's not what we should overlook many people have lost their lives many people have died as a result of um, of fire fire inferno so we must not overlook it we must not underlook it you understand we must not underlook it so um my viewers i'm so much touched and perplexed by um the the three-year-old baby that was reported died at the uh in the in the fire is so touching so touching so touching a child that just came to this world can you imagine and this is how another one happened um in a in a in a in a where we in a in one um, building but this particular one is not a fire anyway this one has to do with sinking a whole building sinked down sinked down and we are still having uh, a newborn baby in that building she see that now so the whole building and the people mm -hmm. inside all sent inside the ground so it was reported that the house was built on a swampy ground you see that so we need something need to be done seriously our nigerian government really need to intervene mm -hmm. on so many so many things and that is why we, we, uh, we are calling for restructuring. That's why we are calling for restructuring. But the, the president is not understanding the situation. He's not understanding what the people are talking about. Okay? So, um, please and um, please, my dear viewers, please, your own comments concerning all that I've just said are very, very important. Alright? Deem it fit to leave them below the comment box. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.